Newcastle. And Andy Cole Hattrick virtually assured the Premiership champions a place in the uh, next stage of the competition, but United's victory was marred by a terrible challenge to Dennis Irwin, who has stretched it off 10 minutes from time. United's Group B rivals Juventus also won. They beat Kozici 3-2 in Turin. Newcastle are virtually out of the competition after being beaten 2-0 by PSV Eindhoven at St. James's Park. Dynamo Kiev won the other match in Group C with an amazing 4-0 win over Barcelona at the New Camp. United came needing a win to give themselves a chance of making the quarter-finals. They left with the points and more from a composed and self-controlled performance. For all that, it was a quiet start and 20 minutes passed before the first meaningful chance on goal. But United were always the sharper around the box. Sheringham forcing a great save from the keeper. And United weren't to be denied for long. Who else but the inform Andy Cole was on the end of Neville's long ball. After that, it just got easier and easier for United. Cole's second came a minute before the break. Feyenoord threatened briefly when Van Bronckhorst's shot rocked the United crossbar after the break. But Cole was just as eager at the other end for his hat-trick. Giggs then tried to get in on the goal-scoring act with a speculative long-range effort. But distance was no problem for Cole's hat-trick. United's triumph threatened to be overshadowed when a high and unpunished tackle on United's Dennis Irwin left the defender rolling in agony and Alex Ferguson fuming at officials and his opposite number on the final bench. The injury wasn't as bad as was first feared but it soured the night for United almost as much as the single goal that Feyenoord managed to pull back late in the half. But it was never going to be enough to knock United out of their stride or stop them from marching on to the quarterfinals. Kerry Dyson, Sky News.